with this all time fantasy draft that I had did. This will look at all the rosters and shit, man. I feel like I drafted a pretty decent team. I ain't gonna lie. I feel like everybody compliment each other. It's gonna be a good little season. I never finished my one in 24. Hopefully, I can finish this one. I want to play every team once and then just send them to the playoff. But it's some good ass teams to sign that I can't wait to play. But yeah, man. I'm gonna let y'all see the rest of these rosters. We're gonna get into the first game, man. Good child. Yeah, that. If you wonder why Mike Williams got on number zero instead of one, man, I can't get one. I don't know what's going on, so I'm just rocking with the zero. He ain't with no other number ever, so I don't really know what to put on. So I just went one under. I tried to get 11. Can't get that either. Cook. But yeah, man. Oh, yeah, and it's my first time playing 2K since September, I think. I think the last time I played 2K was in September. So, yeah, if I'm a little ass, bear with me, man. Then there's Anthony Edwards, then it's Williams, and it's Wimbanyama in at the five spot. Grant, nothing quite like the first game of a brand new season. So many possibilities. Well, you know, B.A., for the players, you're excited and relieved at the same time. You get to see all the hard work you put in during the offseason payoff. The first good move in a long chess match between these coaching staffs. Yeah, now we get to see the counterplay. How you respond is half the battle out there. And Williams has got the ball here for Miami to the middle. Good, and Butler gets the assist. Well, there's Butler making the right play, as he so often does. Rose, left side. Oh, planks that one. He's 0 for 1 to start. You won't see him miss that one too many times. Yeah, it was a great look. Sometimes they don't fall. You've just got to keep taking great shots. Edwards, the pass to Wimbanyama. And the dunk by Wimbanyama. And Wimba Yama can dunk it basically just standing up. you got to keep him out of the paint. Outside Harden. Rose, a screen on Edwards. Well, that's a very early foul for him. Needs to be more careful and not pick up a second one this quarter. Here's this hole. Pass to Daniels. Now here's Rose. And once again, off the mark by Orlando. First quarter of play with about a minute and a half gone by. Edwards against Harden. Outside Edwards. Five to shoot. Shoots over Harden. And Miami again with the bucket. Well, early in this game, they've made one good play after another. The Magic have gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Here in the first quarter, with about two minutes gone by. Here's Harden. Ooh, a little luck that time as it drops. And just taking what the defense gives him. It's good to see Harden knock down the mid-range jumper. Edwards finds Towns. Here's Williams, guarded by Rose. Rose against Williams. And Williams punches it home. And defensively, you have to make him work harder than this, or it's going to be a long night. The Magic have gone one of four to begin this one. And the only question for the Magic, figuring out who will initiate the offense stand. Yeah, Brian, they have great players who can finish players. But the issue they ran into last playoffs was finding someone to set them up. That's something you know they need to address. Now here's Harden. That three off target. Had some space there after the pump fake. Over to the wing. Back to Williams. And it's stolen by Rose. It's a three on three fast break. Here's Harden. No good off the front rim. Another miss. He is struggling for the quarter. Williams up top. Defended by Harden. And the Magic pushing it up now. And he can't get that one. Some solid defense from Williams. Women Yama. They pass to Edwards. Spins. Towns outside. Williams in the post. Defended by Harden. 
Down to five on the shot clock. Now here's Butler. Defense right on it. Kicks it out, Towns. Back to Williams. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. James Harden picks one up. Well, Coach, how about the Eric Spolster story? Started as a video coordinator with the Heat back in 95. You were an assistant in Miami back then. Yeah, look, Brian, even then, Eric is one of the rare guys that all of us on the staff knew right from the beginning that he had all the makings of a great coach. Players trusted him and had confidence in his ability to help them. From the video room to the Hall of Fame one day. No question. Yeah, terrific follow-through for Wimbenyama, proving he has a good head on his shoulders. And so it's Rose who brings up the ball for Orlando. Timeout, timeout. They trail by 11, and we've got a timeout from Jamal Mosley. He's going to talk it over with his guys. All right, let's use this time to check out the teams with the most steals last year. Fifth on the list, the Magic. And this is a team that takes great pride in being aggressive on the defensive end. They take good risk and know when to go after opportunities for steals. To get back on track. And it's blocked. What a play as he just snatches the shot out of midair. Williams against Rose. Magic trail by 13. Now Harden. Rose, a screen on Edwards. Harden from outside. Nails it from three. Harden's got five now. He's never shy to let it go from three-point range. Harden wants to make the D's job as tough as possible. Rose against Williams. Ooh, he's locked in. Dreams his fifth shot in his many attempts. <laughs> this run has been fueled by their Matador defense. Tough call for his coach. Second foul already. We'll see how much the staff trusts him. Orlando making a switch here. Here's Mullen. No made baskets yet. Over Butler. The rebound by Victor Wimbanyama. Wimbanyama's got his fourth rebound in this one. Edwards, the pass to Wimbanyama. And it's stolen by Rose. Oh, and a fast break for the Magic. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. And in the open floor, few guys can finish like D. Rose. Miami leading by 10. Outside, Williams. Rebounded by Daniels. Orlando has gone one of four from deep. Pass to McGinnis. Let's it go from deep. A nice shot by Mullen. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. For Miami, they've gone a fantastic 8 of 11 so far. Wimbanyama screen. Here's Butler. Takes the three. Rose grabs the board. Magic trail by seven. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. And your first NBA coaching job was with the Miami Heat stamp. That was as an assistant back in the 90s, just a few years ago. Yeah, just a few, Brian. And, and the Heat have changed a lot. The game has changed a lot over those years. Look, back then, the Heat were probably the most physical team in the NBA. And it was just knockdown, drag out fights all the time. Ooh, costly foul there. That'll send him to the line for three free throws. This Magic squad, Stan, has a great young core. What do you think they have to do now to take that next step? Well, Brian, they do. They have great depth and a lot of good young players, but they need more shooting around their core guys, and they've got to improve their backcourt position. Their front court is loaded. They've got to get a little bit time more out, balance. Out. And so Jamal Mosley calls for the timeout, and we might see some changes. Coach potentially looking to adjust.
Throws it up high. The pass, the catch, the slam. What a clean play. Man, absolutely jaw-dropping. Williams against Rose. Pass to Wimanyama. Towns outside. And here is Williams. Just five to shoot. Cuts off the pass. Harden from outside. That one falls. Nice feed that time from Rose. Harden's got eight. And what's working here, each guy is willing to make the next pass. Williams against Rose. Williams into the lane. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. That one's on Rose. And let's take a moment to get your take, guys, on the scoring so far for Miami. Well, the way they've been attacking inside is phenomenal. Consistently getting high percentage looks, and that's what great offenses are all about. Another thing that's gone well for them is the mid-range jumper. <laughs> it's been falling with ease so far. Oh, rejected by Wimbanyama. With his length and energy, Wimbayama has the ability to be a game-changing defender. So Miami going with almost an entirely new group here. Porzingis has checked in for Victor Wimbanyama. Pascal Siakam comes in for Carl Anthony Towns. Middleton has checked in for Jimmy Butler. And it's Jalen Brown in for Anthony Edwards. And he gets it to go. Well, when you have a scorer as skilled as he is, you do everything you can to get him the looks he needs. Let's go now to the sideline and catch up with Allie LaForce. Well, this young Magic roster has chemistry. Coach Jamal Mosley said they're so tight together. It's just organic. They're happy in creating these relationships over time. And it's because they're all just good kids that like being around each other. Guys, that's what you want. Yeah, no question. Something to build on, Allie. Thank you. Now here's Harden. Give him eight points now. Pass to Francis. He hits the back iron and sinks it. Francis has got his second bucket on the night. Everyone knows Harden is a talented passer. He can really rack up those assists. Porzingis with it. Here's Williams. The jumper from the wing off target. Outside Harden. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Jalen Brown picks one up. A master of attracting contact. Harden just takes pride in fooling defenders and getting those calls. And the second free throw is good. The hallmark of this Orlando team, their defense, which led them to the playoffs last year, Coach. Well, Brian, they were second in defensive rating. They've got great size. They're young and active. This is a great defensive team. And what's scary for the rest of the East, this team is still on the way up. Orlando with the ball. The Heat making their last shot. Outside Harden. Porzingis against Drummond. Pass to Mullen. Can't get it to drop. Good D by Porzingis. Heat leading by five. Middleton from the outside. Knocks it down from distance. The big story thus far, how well they've shot the rock. Here's Francis. See Occam with the defensive effort. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. There's no air space there whatsoever. That's as close as you can get without foul. Here's Mullen. Down low. And then Harden with the jam. If given the space, Harden's not afraid to take it to the rim. Miami has gone two for three from outside the arc. Brown with a screen. Here's Williams. It's hauled in by the Magic. Here's Francis. 13 feet out. And another basket for Orlando. And so it's Williams with it. He brings it up for Miami. They lead by four. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Magic. I'm not sure what happened there. You just can't give away possessions in this league. We've got 113 left to play in the first quarter. Pass to McGinnis. Here's Francis. Williams defending. 
Francis can't get it to go. Heat leading by four. Williams with it. 16 points for him. Middleton outside. Williams with the screen. Jacks up a three. Later grabs a miss. No question who's in control of the board so far. Francis, the pass to McGinnis. Well, Coach, the Heat have had some deep playoff runs recently, making the finals twice in five years. Yeah, Brian, and what's really interesting is that they've only been higher than a five seed once in that span. They just hit a different gear in the playoffs. And he's good on the second. And the Heat unveiling the statue of Dwayne Wade, Stan, the face of the franchise forever. Yeah, Brian, you think of what he meant to this organization, propelling it to its very first championship and then attracting other stars to Miami. He is truly the foundation. Williams misses. Magic trail by three. Pass to Francis. On the right block. Inside, McGinnis. Great D that time from Porzingis. Well, a good close contest so far as we beat here. Well, it looks like hitting the boards hard was an emphasis of their attack. They knew how valuable it was to do so. Yeah, we're not surprised by this. These guys work hard and they are physical. Pascal Siakam out there with Kristaps Porzingis. Then it's Williams, then it's Jalen Brown, and it's Middleton in at the three, the small forward. That's the group on the floor for Miami. Outside, Williams. Just five on the clock. And it's out of bounds to the Heat as Miami retains possession. Four on the clock. Well, there's the shot clock violation. So they'll turn it over. And here we have last season's best free throw shooting teams. The Heat in fifth. Well, as a coach, it's a relief knowing free throws are almost automatic for your guys. Here's Francis. Pass to Mullen from deep three-point land. Williams grabs the board. Williams has got a sixth rebound on the night. Starting the second quarter, about a minute gone. And growing up in California, Stan, when did you first fall in love with the game of basketball? Well, Brian, my dad coached for a long time, and I just remember going to his practices and going to his games. I can't remember a time where I didn't love the game. And Williams drops them both. Well, he's been very good at the line, and we all know free throws can make or break you in the end. Just over a minute has passed here in the second quarter. Francis gets the bucket. Rock solid screen right there. The defender got completely lost. Yeah, you've got to lock and trail hard. You can't allow him a clean look from that. Now here's Williams. He's got 18. Brown with a screen. Siakam for three. There's the steal. To the paint. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Heat. The Heat with the lead. And here is Williams. They kick it out to Porzingis. Porzingis sets a screen. And here's Brown for three. Bullseye! Jalen Brown! And that's good decision-making by Brown in the pick-and-roll. He'll make the right read more often than not. Francis, the pass to Mullen. Here's Francis. Williams defending. 
Let's it go from 14. The bank shot, no good. They've been dominating the boards tonight, yet it's still a close game. And he's now 6 for 11 after that one. And defensively, that's just not going to cut it. Magic trail by 7. And we've got a timeout from Jamal Mosley. He's going to gather the troops and talk it over. Yeah, hoping to tap into something that'll get them clicking. Yeah, they just have to be more patient. Less forcing and more passing. And we're just over two and a half minutes into the second. Come get it, come get it. To the left side wing. Here's this hole. And once again, off the mark by Orlando. With the step back. Back to Williams. Shot clock at five. Back to Porzingis. No good from outside. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. And the basket by Issel. Issel's got his first basket of the night. His playmaking is something to watch. Threading that pass right in there. Now here's Williams. Tight defense on him. Drives to the hoop. And Williams punches it home. <laughs> I'll tell you, those finishes are always extra special when they come from your point guard. Oh, forget about his passing. Can we see more dunking? Wow, that is an impressive vertical for a point guard. My goodness. When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. And Williams has got the ball here for Miami. And Williams punches it home. Wow, that type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch. That's certainly a big-time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. Here's Petrie. Miami making their last shot. And Porzingis with the block. Yeah, it's not easy to keep a shot out of Porzingis. Oh, he packs it down. That is incredible. Come on now, guys. That's flat out insane. Hey, when's the last time you saw a jam like that? McGinnis, the pass to Mullen. Here's Francis. Defended by Brown. Francis gets the bucket. Francis has got six points in the quarter. That's his second triple this quarter. I guess he's left that dry spell behind. Siakam the screen. Now here's Williams. The D's right on him. Up top, Siakam. The Heat need to get one up in a hurry. Porzingis with room to shoot. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Siakam. A multi-level scorer. Porzingis can find a shot in any area on the floor. And one thing that Siakam has always had a knack for, Graham, cutting to the rim and finishing plays. Yeah, he plays so well when he has space to move. He's just great off the ball, and that fits with any team. His ability to convert at the rim makes his cuts that much better. Stan, back in your early coaching days, what was the dynamic working with the front office? Well, I was in good situations, and so you need the coach in the front office in sync where you're all working toward the same goals and you understand what the process is going to look like. And how in sync were you when Stan was the coach and Stan was the front office? We had problems then because... The coach didn't like the front office very often, and the front office was always unhappy with the coach. <laughs> and they've committed to controlling the boards, and it's paying dividends. Deflects the pass, and it's stolen by Rose. Here's Petrie, guarded by Edwards. Oh, it's blocked by Wimbanyama. In the long reach of Wimbanyama. Certainly one of the more feared shot blockers in the league. The free throw drops for Williams. Zero wasted trips. 
They're doing their job at the line. Orlando making a switch here. And Williams drops them both. Magic trail by 10. Rose, the pass to Issel. Over Wimbanyama. Oh, it's blocked by Wimbanyama. Outside, Williams. Pass to Towns. Issel with a rebound. Orlando has gone 5 of 10 from beyond the three-point line in this game. You know, it's great to see Rose out there. After all those injuries, Derek still has a passion for the game. He's gone 2 for 2 at the line so far. And that one falls for Rose. This is how you stay in the game. They're doing a beautiful job from the line. 100% this quarter. And so Rose knocks them both down. Miami leading by eight. Now here's Wimbanyama. Six points for him. Williams finds Wimbanyama. Pass to Butler. Right side, Williams. Five on the clock. Oh, there's the alley! And it's powered home by Towns. Well, nice touch on the lob. And Towns made sure to finish the play. Magic trail by 10. Now Rose. Six points for him. To the inside. Here's this hole. And it's Miami with a rebound. Wimbanyama's got five rebounds tonight. Williams against Rose. Nice move. Orlando grabs the miss. Here's McDaniel. Still no points. Pass to Rose. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. They found their rhythm at the free throw line this quarter. Trying hard to make up ground. So far, he's made all of his shots at the foul line. Going four for four. That one's off. He hits the second from the line. Williams with it. 28 points for him. Wimbanyama, screen on Rose. Williams passes to Wimbanyama. And another shot. Wow, Victor takes it to him inside. They've been a little soft with their defense on the interior. And so it's Rose with it. He brings it up for the Orlando Magic. 11-point game. Issel, pass to Rose. Orlando again missing. Impressive closeout on a skilled shooter. That is how you defend shots from downtown. Oh, who else? Wimbanyama. Wimbanyama barely even has to elevate when he throws it down. Magic trail by 13. Here's Rose. Seven points in the game. Takes a 13-footer, and it's good as he snugs it right through the net. Harden's got 13 now. Nice pass inside, making things easy for him now. Wimbanyama screen. Here's Williams. The shot, no good. Good D by Rose. Orlando has gone two of four from the perimeter in the second so far. Wing shot on the way, and he connects with a jumper. Rose has got five points now this quarter. Stopping on a dime. Rose with precision shooting. Williams on the wing. Guarded by Rose. Outside Wimbanyama. Williams a screen on Harden. Clock at six. Anthony Edwards reigns one in. Now shooting the three ball at almost 60%. They've been blazing this second quarter. Now here's Rose. Nine points in the game. Pass to McGinnis. Back to Rose. The Magic need to put one up here. Here's this hole. Rebound Miami. Wimbanyama's got rebound number eight here already in the game. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. Let's it go. And Edwards the bucket on the assist from Williams. Williams has got six assists in the game. Magic trail by 14. 
Rose outside over Williams. Victor Wimanyama grabs the board. Well, I hate to say it, but he hasn't done a lot to help their cause tonight. He's been a little erratic from the floor. Here's Williams, and it's stolen by Rose. Oh, and a fast break for the Magic. Here's Harden. Here's McDaniel. Pass to Issel. Here's Rose. Oh! And slammed at home, and a foul. A chance at another point at the line. It's going to be on Carl Anthony Towns. And that one falls for Rose. Here in the second period, he's made a concerted effort to attack and get himself to the line. Now Williams. And he's got 28 now. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. And early on, he was drawing a lot of contact and getting to the stripe. But that hasn't been the story here in the second quarter. The free throw drops for Williams. And Williams drops them both. Magic trail by 13. And 101 left in the half. Up high and down it goes on the lob. I would imagine it's nearly impossible to not get fired up after that play. Grant, check these guys out on the bench. Their reaction says it all. They are fired up. Butler can't get it to go. Orlando has gotten five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. <laughs> wow. Rose looking just as tenacious as ever. He isn't intimidated by the close D at all. In the game, he shot six of seven from the line. And I love how efficient he's been at the charity strike. And so Rose knocks them both down. Heat leading by nine. There's 37 seconds left in the first half of this game. The kick out to Edwards. Pass to Towns. And it's stolen by Rhodes. Here we go. Williams grabs the board. Williams has got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Punches it home. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Here's this hole. No good with the triple. And so it's the Miami Heat. They lead by 11 as the quarter comes to a close. There wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. Magic trail by 11. Here's who Jamal Mosley is starting the second half with. We've got James Harden. He's out there with Derrick Rose. And it's Issel in at the four-man position. Harden against Edwards. Just four to shoot. From deep, Rose. He drops it from range. Rose has got 17 points. And at the arc, Rose definitely picks his battles. But when he sees his chance, he knocks it down. Here's Williams. Got a hand on it. Rose against Towns. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. You stand in this league. The opportunity always exists to make a name for yourself. It certainly does, Brian. And guys that maybe haven't gotten their opportunity, if they're ready when they get it, then they're going to burst onto the scene and they'll no longer be under the radar guys look at a guy like Jalen Brunson second round pick bench guy in Dallas for a long time and then now an all-star here's Williams oh plenty of contact on that shot officials call the foul and he'll take two free throws now that one's on Rose <laughs> man the defender really went after him the free throw drops for Williams And Williams drops them both. Second half rolling along. About a minute played here. Harden, the pass to Mullen. Harden surveying the D. Oh, deflected and stolen by Williams. 
Drops in the layup for two. Williams has got four points in the quarter. Keep getting him the ball. He's been a huge part of this offense. Inside. Here's Francis. Nice pass. Nice catch. And a resounding dunk. Oh, wait. Big finish. Big time. And man, did they need that. You can tell he's trying to get him going with that dunk. Yeah, he saw the opportunity to finish with some authority. Trying to fire his guys up. Towns outside. Shot clock at five. Outside Butler. From deep. The three dropped in by Jimmy Butler. Yeah, Butler with the quick trigger there off the catch. Nicely done. Francis, the pass to Harden. Here's Francis. Buries it down low. Francis has got 16 points now. Easy look when the defender isn't fighting over the screen. Yeah, it's certainly worth it to disrupt the offense. Coaches notice that extra effort. It's good on the putback. And the Heat lead by 11. Time and time again, they're creating good looks from close range. And we've got a timeout from Jamal Mosley. He wants to give him a breather and talk things over. Orlando has gotten 6 of 13 shots to go from outside the arc. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Mullen can't get it to go. Well, after three straight minutes, that's their first miss of the half. It's Edwards on the wing. He launches a three. And it's Miami with a rebound. Williams has got rebound number 11. Well, he just doesn't have it right now. It's as simple as that. And his team is struggling as a result. <laughs> Excellent way to pad the lead. Yeah, especially when it's your one throwing it down like that. It shows you're able to attack the rim from any position. Edwards against Harden. Pass to Mullen. Outside Harden. Just five to shoot. Over Edwards. Ooh, lands soft on the front of the rim and drops in. He's got 15. It's impressive how Harden makes room inside. He finds a way to navigate the shots. Now here's Towns. Back to Williams. Oh! oh, oh. Wow! And he hammers in the reverse slam. And this kind of six slam is just one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game right now, B.A. You know, there's an edge the way they play and a confidence they're not afraid to show. Harden's shot is good. Well, he's been able to find points, just not enough of them. They've got to string together some more buckets. And so it's Williams with it. He brings it up for Miami. They've led by as many as 14. Towns for three. Orlando with the rebound. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's a shot he typically makes. Here's Francis. Yes, and a nice assist from Harden. Harden's got four assists now tonight. And remember, James Harden is usually a front runner in the league in assists. He has great vision. Williams passes to Towns. Back to Williams. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Towns. Looking back at last season, the best when it comes to shot blocking. Victor Wimbanyama, number one. Even when the ball would swing away from him, he would rotate and challenge the shot. A big group substitution here for Miami. Kristaps Porzingis, he's checked in for Wimbanyama. Siakam comes in for Towns. Middleton has checked in for Butler. And it's Jalen Brown in for Edwards. Here's Daniels, defended by Porzingis. Harden against Williams. To the paint. And stolen by Porzingis. Let's get a report from Allie. Jalen Brown is playing with so much confidence. He said, quote, I feel like I'm a different player. My body has changed. Athletically, I'm entering my prime. I'm more aware on defense and offense. I feel like on both sides of the ball, I'm playing the best basketball of my life. Well, it shows Allie for sure. Tries to spin move. Here's Williams with the drive. Issel with a rebound. 
Bissell's got a rebound, number five here tonight. Harden with it. Guarded now by Williams. And he comes up with a bucket. Harden's got 20 points. And, you know, you can't underestimate Harden's ability to blow by defenders. It opens things up for him on the offensive side. Williams passes to Porzingis. Back to Williams. Pass to Brown. Floats one up. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. Well, you've got to foul Brown harder than this because he does convert well through contact. And now we'll get a perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for the Heat. Well, they're shot blocking. The defensive effort level has been great. You've got to love that intensity. Well, another major factor in the offensive performance was the fast break. Converting on those chances when they get them tonight. Pass to Harden. Beyond the arc. Knocks down the long J. Harden's got 10 points here in the second half. And any decent look from distance, he's taking it. He has that locked-in mentality right now. Well, he's firing away with confidence from downtown. The defense better adjust to this and fast. Williams with the screen. That's good. And so Middleton with the assist. Williams has got 44. Well, they just need to keep getting him the ball. He has been terrific this quarter. Williams against Harden. Pass to Mullen. Back to Harden. Here's McGinnis. Here's Harden. Some solid defense from Williams. Oh, gritty defense. Protecting the rim at all costs against a guy who has all sorts of ways to finish. Magic trail by seven. Here's Mullen. From outside, off the mark. I mean, he's trying to shoot his way out of what's becoming a prolonged cold streak. Yeah, I get it. But you don't want him forcing things. It's better to get your shots within the flow of the offense. Harden, the pass to McGinnis. Here's Francis. Williams defending. Rebound by Middleton. That's the shot you hope for. Right at the rim. Just couldn't capitalize. Williams passes to Porzingis. Operating inside. Porzingis. Well, for Porzingis, that's just easy money. I keep going to that until they stop it. Stan, we've seen a resurgence for Kristaps Porzingis over the last few seasons. What changed? Well, Brian, he really dug down into the numbers, identifying his best shot profile and really focusing on that. It's helped his efficiency. A free throw drops for Williams. If they keep hitting free throws at this clip, it'll help them seal the deal. And Williams drops them both. And you see player training methods, Grant, a lot more than just running and getting shots up. And you know, B.A., what interests me, players not just training their bodies better than ever, but also their minds. They're working on hand-eye coordination drills and just all kinds of stuff to enhance their reflexes. Doing what he can to help shrink the deficit, but it has to be a team effort. Here's Francis. Oh, it's blocked by Williams. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Hey, if you can't block it, sending him to the line can be the next best thing. And Williams drops them both. And here's Harden. He'll bring it up for the Orlando Magic. They trail by 11. Pass to McGinnis. Back to Harden. Here's the pick. 4-3. Fires in the triple. Harden's got 28. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. Outside, Williams. Siakam outside. Back to Williams. Kick out to Brown. Clock at four. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. 
First free throw is good. And that's good as he hits both shots. Magic trail by 10. Pass to McGinnis. The top of the key jumper is on the mark. Yeah, that's what they want to see. He has to start asserting himself. They need him to take command of this game. Here's Williams. Kick out to Brown. Middleton passes to Siakam. Outside, Brown. It's good. And give the assist to Siakam. Brown's got six here in the quarter. Well, you know, when Brown's hitting the three, it really opens up this offense. Francis, the pass to McGinnis. Yep, that one's good. McGinnis has got his second basket of the night. It's interesting. They definitely had more three-point attempts in the first half. Not sure why they went away from it. Here's Williams. Kicks it out to Middleton. Out of bounds. It'll be magic ball. One thirty-six left in the third quarter here. Here's Francis, defended by Brown. Here's Petrie. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Kristaps Porzingis picks one up. And he knocks down the first one. Fall, so he hits both of them. And we've seen some good free throw shooting in the second half. Miami leading by seven. Williams with it. What an incredible scoring display he's putting on tonight. Williams with the screen. Just five on the clock. Going inside. Oh, connects again. <laughs> That's 52 points for him. Making it all look too easy right now. Here's Francis. Defended by Brown. The first free throw is good. That one misses, so he goes one for two. Miami has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. Here's Williams. Ah, nice fake there to create the shot, but it's no good. Francis, pass to Issel. Here's Francis, defended by Brown to the middle. And stolen by Williams. Down low. Here's the second effort. Back to Brown. Orlando with a rebound. Here's Francis. Give him 20. The ball's knocked loose. And stolen by Williams. That'll count. It's good! It's good at the buzzer! Wow! Makes his selection just in time. Well done. Well, it's good to have... And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth quarter. We've got Butler, Anthony Edwards out there with Williams. And then it's Carl Anthony Towns. And it's Wimbanyama in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's the group on the floor for Miami. Here's McDaniel. Here's Harden. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. Yeah, and so many defenders fall for the Harden fake because he's such a prolific scorer. Harden hits them both. 
such a versatile guard. James Harden is a triple-double threat every single night. Outside, Williams. Outside, Butler. Pass to Edwards. And there's the lob. Blows the alley-oop. That is a rarity. When he takes flight, he usually hammers it home. Here's Francis, guarded by Edwards. Back to Harden. From downtown. Rebound by the Heat. Towns has got five rebounds tonight. Here's McDaniel. Butler covering. Here's Francis. It's good. Off the assist from Harden. Harden's got his fifth assist in this one. Yeah, he's leading the charge for them. But let's be honest, he needs more help if they're going to get out in front. Well, consistent scoring is a good foundation for a comeback. They can't be wasting possessions now. I'm sure he'd like to have that back. That's a missed opportunity. Towns outside. Outside, Williams. Pass to Wimanyama. Shot clock at six. And here's Butler outside. Connects from downtown. And the Heat lead by nine. Over his career, Butler's maybe been a little erratic from distance, but he always takes them with confidence. Three-pointer, Harden. Miami grabs the miss. They've led by as many as 14. Now here's Williams. He's covered closely. Good! That's another bucket! And he's nearing the single-game franchise scoring record. Absolutely on fire. Already a night to remember and approaching some history. Yeah, I'm not sure if he's going to be able to shoot his way out of this one or not. Over two and a half minutes in the books here in the fourth. Good. Williams has got 58. Well, he's had a night. This team feeds off of his energy. And every time they've needed a bucket, he's delivered. And stolen by Williams. He goes up. He got it again. Sensational. 60 points. This guy can't be stopped right now. They've had no answer for him in this one. Harden against Edwards. Pass to Francis. Will it go? Oh, and Towns with the block. Good instincts from Towns defensively to find the block. And his reach also helps him out there. Francis. Boy, they had their chances. Two offensive rebounds, but still coming up empty. And Williams has got the ball here for the Miami Heat. Here in the fourth, they've allowed just four points. The kick out to Edwards. Hits the trifecta. And it hasn't just been their stellar offense. Their defense has been effective as well. Great example of how to build a lead and then sustain it. You win games on both ends of the floor. Here's McDaniel. Butler covering. Edwards against Harden. Pass to McDaniel. Six on the shot clock. Here's this hole. Here's Daniels. Williams grabs the board. And they are really struggling to stop this run. Well, this is a spot where you have to be able to go to your leaders. They need to step up and make a play. Another one falls. Amazing. Never in the history of the franchise have we seen a game like this. He's putting on a remarkable performance. It's their all-time single-game scoring record. Their fans will be reliving this game for a long time. Here's Petrie. Yes, and a nice assist from Harden. Tossing the pass to the interior. That's what you want to do. Get into the paint. Outside, Williams. And it's good. He hits another one. This game has his name written all over it. He has been phenomenal. An offensive onslaught. To the paint. The jump hook. Boy, clanks that one off the back iron and it falls. Petrie's got four points this quarter. 
Well, the analytics would say take either that shot or something from downtown. Outside, Williams. Here's Butler. The kick out to Williams. And he lobs it up to the rim. Pass to Petrie. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It's going to be on Carl Anthony Towns. And the first one at the line is good. So Miami going with almost an entirely new group here. Kristaps Porzingis, he's checked in for Victor Wimbanyama. Pascal Siakam comes in for Towns. Chris Middleton's checked in for Jimmy Butler. And it's Brown in for Anthony Edwards. Middleton outside. Outside, Williams. Back to Middleton. Siakam outside. Williams in the post. Guarded by Rose. And Williams gets the bucket on the assist from Siakam. Magic trail by 19. Pass to Petrie. Back to Rose. Here's Mullen. Orlando again missing. Well, and after making just one triple going into the break, he's still looking for his first make from distance here in the second half. And he makes a first. And we haven't seen a new franchise join the NBA stand since the Charlotte Bobcats in 2003. 20 years later, though, things seem to be percolating a bit. Well, you've seen it, Brian. There's some deep pockets out there in some great markets, all vying to get into the action. And we know that the NBA is all about growth. Pass to McGinnis. Now Harden, defended by Brown. Six to shoot. And he's headed to the line for two. He gets the whistle there. One of the most creative offensive talents in the game. Harden simply just has a knack for creating contact. That's good from Harden. He's perfect from the line this time. And it's Miami's ball. They're on a 20-7 run. Williams against Rose. Williams into the lane. Rebounded by Daniels. Daniels has got four rebounds now. Middleton against Rose. Pass to McGinnis. Here's Daniels. And yep, it's good. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. Yeah, you got to love that kind of effort. Getting in there and fighting through the defense. Williams against Rose. Williams passes to Siakam. Now Porzingis. Five to shoot to the inside. Here's Williams. Got a piece of it. And that'll be Miami's ball as it goes out of bounds. Heat able to keep the possession. So Miami going with almost an entirely new group here. Victor Wimbanyama's checked in for Kristaps Porzingis. Towns comes in for Siakam. Jimmy Butler's checked in for Middleton. And it's Anthony Edwards in for Jalen Brown. And again, no good by Miami. Magic trail by 17. Here's Mullen. Pass to Harden. Rose outside. And he lobs it up. Tipped. Going all the way to the rack. Hits yet again. Wow. And that's 70. He is unconscious. And so it's Rose who brings up the ball for the Orlando Magic. Over Williams. Rose with the bucket. Rose has got 21 points in the game. Oh, boy, what control and poise from Rose. Taking the hit like a champ and just powering right through it. Towns, a screen on Rose. Williams passes to Towns. Some room here for Williams. Another one goes. Incredible. What a game from him. 72 points. And he's been simply sensational throughout this one. Pass to Daniels. Now here's Harden, guarded by Edwards. 
Harden drives in. Rebound by the Heat. Towns has got his seventh rebound of the game with that last one. Now here's Williams. He's guarded closely. Outside Edwards. Williams with the screen. And he gets the friendly roll as that one goes. Edwards got five points now this quarter. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. Yeah, come on. They're just having their way out there and continuing to press the advantage. And now let's present our New Balance player of the game. And I'll tell you what, this was one easy pick for sure. From the start, he looked in total control for the entire game. It's incredible to see a player outperforming everyone else on the court. And you know, this home arena really appreciates this guy. And it's clear that he takes pride in playing his best in front of them. And it's Williams off the drive. And good! There's another! Unreal! He's got the fourth most points ever in an NBA game. This man is on another planet. I mean, what can you say? What are the all-time great individual performances in league history? Honestly, guys, I don't know how you stop him. He's in the mid-70s scoring-wise. Wilt's 78, Kobe's 81, and then Wilt's 100 are the only higher-scoring games ever. Here's Harden. And that time, also a missed shot. Something's off about him this quarter. Yeah, and sometimes guys just start pressing. The best thing for him is to just slow it down and concentrate on solid shot selection. Outside for Wimbanyama. That three's off the mark. Fantastic ball movement for them tonight. If things are definitely working offensively, a balanced attack is just so much harder to defend. From the high post. Rose can't connect. Miami has gone two of three from beyond the arc here in the fourth. It's safe to say they have dominated this game. The game wasn't even as close as the score says in a great win for the Heat. Boy, this was one physical game, guys. <laughs> they obviously felt that was an advantage of theirs coming in, and they were able to be relentless inside as a result. And so this win marks their first victory of the new year. It's just the start of this season series with three games left between them. Oh, he hits again. That puts him even for third on the single game scoring list. Simply amazing. Man, I'm at a loss for words. His has been one of the greatest offensive games we'll ever see. Yeah, 78 points tying Will Chamberlain's big night back in 61. Up next, Kobe Bryant's 81 points from 2006. Yeah, and he seems to have lost his rhythm all of a sudden. This has not been his quarter. Williams finds Edwards. 19-footer. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And he drops the first. Williams drops them both. 24 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Rose outside. Back to Harden. Pass to Rose. Down to five on the shot clock. Three-pointer. No luck on that one. There's another rebound. And he hauls in his 20th rebound. Oh, <laughs> just dominating the glass. So no problem for Miami as they get the win. Well, this might not have been the most competitive game we've ever seen, but you've got to appreciate their masterful performance. And I'm sure their fans appreciated it too. We saw the outstanding defense and a loaded... We was going crazy. Effort, defense. Immaculate. <laughs> we had horrible picks, but I made it work. I feel like my team amazed. I don't know how these even slipped through the crack. Like, you let me get Edwards, Jalen Brown, Wimby. Let's just go on. But this ain't even some of the best teams that we're going to play. But Francis was going stupid. Like, why is he doing that? But tried to cook me all game. But yeah, man, that's the end of the day. But it's a little a random sneak peek, though. Hey, if you seen it, you seen it. But hold that L, Hank. And I was playing locks, so ignore the stat. But deuces, man.